Hi and welcome to Spice and Pans. Today we will be cooking stir fried pork with shiitake mushroom and vegetables. So let's start cooking. Before we marinate the pork, we need to cut it out first. I have with me over here 200 grams of pork loin. In Chinese, we call this yao zi rou. This is very very tender. But to make it even more tender, I'll show you how I cut this. To have tender pork, you need to cut against the grain. As you can see, the grain is like this, so we need to cut it this way. right? Regardless of what meat, for stir fry, you need to cut against the grain to have a very tender piece of meat. All right, I'll show you how I cut it right now. Grain is here, so you cut it this way. Slice it thinly. This is how I slice it to be, as thin as possible. right? Continue. Once I'm done, I'll show you how I marinate this. To marinate this and make it tender, there's a few steps that we need to do. Very importantly, add a little bit of water, 2 tablespoons of water to 200 grams of pork. Do not use salt for marinade, it will toughen up the pork. I'm adding in 1.5 tablespoons of light soya sauce, low sodium. Put it in first. Add in 1 third of a teaspoon of sugar. Add in a few dashes of pepper. Now we will mix them up and let the pork absorb all this liquid first. Just mix them up. Now when you mix until there's no water over here like this, that means the pork has absorbed all the juices of the liquid inside and it will be very tender and juicy. Next, we'll add in a little bit of egg white. This is approximately one third of an egg, egg white. Pour it in. Same thing, mix it up first. Make sure it's coated well. This will help the tenderize process also. It will make this pork really, really tender. And this is what we want. Next, we add in half a tablespoon of corn flour. In Chinese cooking, most of the time when we want to make the pork tender, we'll add in corn flour. It can be pork, it can be chicken, it can be beef. Right? Mix them up well. Once you mix them up well, add in a little bit of oil. There's two advantages as to why we are adding in the oil. Firstly, it will seal off the meat, making it very juicy and it will not lose too much of a juice when you stir fry it. Secondly, it's easier to separate them when you fry them. So we'll leave this to marinate about 10-20 minutes and I'll show you how I prepare the sauce. Now we'll prepare the sauce. I have with me over here 80 milliliters of water. Very simple. Add in 1 tablespoon of light soya sauce. 1 tablespoon of oyster sauce 1 third of a teaspoon of sugar and 1 third of a teaspoon of salt Add in a few dashes of pepper Half a tablespoon of corn flour and stir them up well Once this is done, we'll proceed to put our dish together Now we'll put the dish together Heat up your pan using medium heat Add in a good amount of oil. A little bit more will be good because we are going to fry our pork. Swirl the oil around. Right, when it's swirl easily like this, that means the oil is hot enough. We'll add in our pork now. Spread them out. And leave them to fry for a while before we turn them over. Try to make sure that the pork has contact with the pan. We have sliced the pork quite thinly, so it will get cooked pretty fast. Once we see the edges starts to turn quite like this, we'll flip it to the other side. This is a very simple and delicious dish. Excellent with steamed rice. We'll fry them until they are no longer red. Just spread them out. When you don't see any redness on the pork and it has browned a little, we'll add in our garlic. Three cloves of garlic chop, add them in. Move them around. We'll fry until we can smell the beautiful fragrance from the garlic. Wow, smelling really, really fantastic. Once we can smell the garlic, we'll add in our mushroom. 100 grams of shiitake mushroom, sliced thickly like this. Add them all in. I'm using fresh shiitake mushroom. 
Of course, you can use any mushroom that you want. We'll just mix them around first. Then we're adding our greens. I'm using baby kailan, 100 grams. You can use any of your favorite greens, no problem at all. Put everything in. Fry them until your desired doneness. If you like it more crunchy, or whether you like it more tender, it's really up to you. This stir fry is very fast to cook and easy to cook. And because it has greens, it has protein, it's really a one dish meal. All right, once we have cooked the best for our desired doneness, we are adding our sauce. Give the sauce a good stir first. Pour it all over. Just mix them up like this. Now if you like a little bit of color in your dish, just add in a little bit of dark soya sauce. It can be half or one tablespoon, it's really up to you. Next you will splash one tablespoon of Shing wine and half a tablespoon of sesame oil. Mix them all up and it's time for our lunch. Wow, beautiful. And now the dish is done, let's have a taste. <sighs> Smells really good. Let's try the pork. Oh, super, super tender. Very flavorful. Just absorb the oyster sauce, the very nice taste of the soya sauce. Really good. The mushroom. Mm. And finally the veg. I love the contrast of texture in this dish. Very tender pork and very crunchy vegetables. And the sauce on steamed rice, huh, fantastic. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you like our video. Do click like on our video and do subscribe to our channel. And now it's your turn to cook. See you, bye bye. Wow. Very nice.